what's happening guys so we're gonna do a little different today i'm gonna show i'm gonna show you guys how to get the diamonds uh preserved you can keep them in their cool little souvenirs after you catch your sturgeon so all i got right now is some water boiling in a pot okay let me clamp this thing down here Save the whole back strap off my sturgeon that I caught. This is it, okay? Tail, all that. Diamonds are in there, okay? Just gonna throw it in the, in the boiling water. And you're gonna pretty much boil that until all the meat falls off the, off the diamonds. Scoops. It's gonna smell pretty bad, so I'm doing it with no tone. But uh, yeah, we'll give it a minute here and you know, let's just see what it looks like once, once it's done. So we're now about close to 30 minutes into it. And this stuff reeks. But check it out. It's pretty much fallen all apart. Yeah. I'm let this boil out a little longer. This is really falling apart. Give that another 25 minutes or so. And then uh, we'll put it through the strainer and try to get the remaining layers of meat off those, those diamonds, okay? All right, so it's been close to an hour now that we've been cooking this thing. I'm gonna shut it down and show you what it looks like now. Okay, it's all pretty much just fell off. Some diamonds sitting there. So, put the strainer out. Here we go. Ooh, look at that. No wish. Some smelly stuff. because I gotta pretty much have to pick apart some of the meat off the diamonds. Um, we'll just cool down for a second here. Okay. There's one right there. See that? That is a diamond. One of the scoops. There's another one, two. Seven, 
love it. Save from two previous fish. One was Matt. Fishman's alive because diamonds are in here somewhere. So I'm gonna give him some souvenirs. And the other one. They pretty much just boil it till it just falls off the bone, off the meat and whatnot. It's really soft. You may want to use gloves. You know, I don't really care. I'm used to touching fish and bait and whatnot. I've been doing this for a long time. Doesn't really bug me. But it still does stink. So I'll for sure watch my hands afterwards with bleach, some soap. I think that's it, we got them all. Alright. Make sure you get rid of this stuff. I'm not sure why for family members just come home smelling this nasty stuff. Diamonds here. Okay. There's scoops, whatever you want to call them. Alright. Just spray them with a little bit of a little bit of bleach. Kind of widen them up. sit there for about five minutes okay it's 9 42 so let's say 9 47 we're gonna come back and check on these okay we'll see what they look like all right it's been about like five minutes we're gonna give these a little rinse some uh, warm water let's see what they look Still some stuff falling off of it. Some, if it's just dirt or whatnot. But we're gonna do another layer of bleach. Pour rock spray. Okay. 
time we're gonna add a little bit of hot water to the mix. Water to make more, nice and hot. Another five minutes or so, we'll come back to it. Should be done by then. All right guys, so that's the finished product right there. Those, those are the diamonds or scoots from the sturgeon. And uh, that's the end result, cool little souvenir. I got a buddy of mine, Captain Anthony, he's got some of these, he made a necklace out of them. He's made a little hole and put some kind of string. It's pretty cool. So we'll have to get these on that, that rod being built so hope you enjoyed the video and give you something to do with your uh, your diamonds from your surgeon cool little souvenir all right guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it subscribe like share i'll see you guys soon with some more videos